Now we have developing news from Virginia Beach. Two people are dead, another in critical condition after a late night shooting. It happened just before 10 o'clock last night on New Colony Drive in Virginia Beach off Providence Road in Kempsville. Then your side's Haley Mylon is live with more on the search for suspects tonight. Haley. Tom, that's right. Two men are dead. Another man is in critical condition fighting for his life in the hospital. Now, Virginia Beach police haven't said whether they have any suspects or any persons of interest in this case. This all happened right here on New Colony Drive. Neighbors on either side of the street say bullets went flying last night. Families on both sides say bullets went into their homes. Now, a man living right here tells me he's not going to put up with crime in his neighborhood. Um, got gunshots through uh, his room, um, so I am angry. Patrick McKinney discovered a bullet flew right through his nine-year-old son's bedroom. Fortunately, his son wasn't home. How do you sleep at night? A bullet missed yeah. son's, your son's bedroom. But Not well. Not well. He says Stony Brook Park across the street presents a safety problem. Another neighbor agrees, sharing that it's hardly lit at night. And most of the time it's just harmless. They're just hanging out, but it's dark and you don't know people are there if you pull up. A mother on the same street saying the shots rang out just before 10 last night while she was playing with her young kids. So we just want to get everybody to the same floor at that moment. I didn't I did not look out the windows. I turned some lights off and I got everybody down. When I saw cops heard him coming, that's when I started looking out the window. McKinney is calling on his neighbors to pressure the city to make some changes. I want more lights in the in the park over here. And he's looking into purchasing high resolution cameras to capture any crime nearby. A pricey investment. I'm not putting up with it. It's between that or moving out and we're cleaning it up here. As police work to find the shooter, neighbors say they're nervous about heading outside at night now. It just makes you be a little more cautious. Make sure you tell the kids be aware of their surroundings. If you know anything about this incident that can help police, you should call the crime line or submit an anonymous tip through the P3 Tips app. Now, McKinney, the man who you heard from who lives across the street, says he is filing a uh, notice to the city. He's requesting that they add more lights through the VB311 website. He's urging all of his neighbors to do the same. He says that Stony Brook Park is just far too dark at night. In Virginia Beach, Haley Mylon, 10 on your side. Thank you, Haley.